Where's Eddie? I don't know where he is. Oh my god, where is he hiding? <gasps> Boom! Surprise! Did not see you there. It's because I'm hiding in my hiding camo jacket. Mm, so luscious and soft. Can you guys see? There you go. So today we have six sacrilegious Balan gadgets. That's right. Mm. The six sacrilegious. Time to check out if they are interesting or lamentable. Let's get started. Obviously, some of these gadgets will be applied to a violin. They're meant to help you practice. But we're not going to risk hurting our base. So we've got... Let me go grab it. How much is this violin? I think it was like $150. And it that includes a be. bow. The poor victim of today's episode. The bow. Oh, so in tune. And look at the bow. It's not even undone. This thing Play feels horrible with his neck. That's nasty. Where's the varnish on that? It's like sandpaper. When it's shift, put... you're gonna get like wooden files. You can see your... they just gave up on varnish here. Yeah. You guys see that? <laughs> this part feels very chalky. So, so, first one the wooden practice violin. These handcrafted box violins are great for teaching young violin students aged 2 to 6. They enhance the teaching of technique, proper bow hold, hand positioning, and stance while maintaining interest. Bro. You know, this is just called a toy, it's not called a practice violin. Oh my god! Oh, Wait, look at this. It's meant to help you maintain interest as a violinist, bro. How are you gonna be interested in violin when you don't make I'm a so, sound? Yeah, I'm so interested now. Guess how much this is? Like, $5? Nah, $50. Nani? Discount to $40 though, because I couldn't sell it. That's the next lo-fi. I'm pretty sure your kid will lose interest after they pick this up. I'm pretty sure kids are gonna be like, ooga ooga booga ooga booga. <laughs> I'll just be like, ooga booga <laughs> boom. This is the beating stick if you're, you don't practice. <laughs> 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 it's like ooga booga. Let's make fire. Oh, 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 fire! What would you rate that? Dude, negative one. I rate it a ooga booga out of ten. ten. <laughs> yeah. Next one, don't fret stickers. Ah. Oh, let's see, what is this video? Loosen the strings slightly using the fine tuners. Slide the decal between the fingerboard and the strings and place the narrow end flush up against the nut, aligning its guidelines with the edge of the fingerboard. Fair enough. Yeah. Gradually unpeel the rest of the decal. It actually looks so satisfying. It looks like when you're at the airport and you need to put the luggage slip. Thing. Oh yeah, 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 pre-COVID days, <laughs> yeah, it's a good idea though, because I can sit, whoa, why is there like, more than four, I guess it's all the fingers, but every violin's slightly different, right, that, that is my, because every violin's got a so different feeling, every, every violin is different, which means, unless it's a perfect master of violin, you're actually going to be playing out of tune, the necks are slightly different, the lengths are slightly different, you should just get a teacher with those stickers, separate stickers to put on for you. Yep. Oh, I'm so no. scared it's gonna snap. I yeah. Uh... I think it's gonna snap. I'm not gonna do it all the way. That's it. Yeah. But read this. Adjust the bridge position so that the string length. Wait. Read that again. That's what my that was my reaction. Like, what? Adjust the bridge position so that the string length. Why would you adjust the bridge? Well, this is moving. No, forward. do not do that. That is a horrible idea. But I'm peel approximately two centimeters of the paper backing from the narrow end of the. the yeah, so from here, right? I've aligned it, guys. See the sticky parts there. And then holding peel it. the don't fret in place. Carefully remove the backing. Holding this in place. Holding this sort of. Thing. Okay. And Why what? am I fretting more than ever? I know. Alright, uh, let's test it. Oh, that's too sharp. That's what it's telling that's me. It's too dude. sharp. Well, it should be. So close to this. Are we gonna do the two? Bridge, bro. Three. The idea was nice, but they're just conveniently ignoring the truth that all violins come with different string lengths, and you can't just shift the bridge because the bridge has to be aligned with the F hole indentation yes. and the relationship to the bass bar and the sound post is not arbitrary. Guys, please, if you don't know, check out the Violin Anatomy t-shirt. It will tell you all the violin parts. I'm so triggered. Ay but hey, I think this is staying on this violin now. <laughs> yeah. no, we're not taking that off. Alright, next, gadget. Faulty mouse teaching aid. Acute and highly versatile teaching aid. For advanced concepts, shifting of vibrato. I don't know if I want a mouse on my violin. Train the hand to position by building muscle memory. Mouse or memory. Ah. 
Well, let's see if it works. Unga bunga! Yeah, unga bunga, unga bunga! What? Oh, yeah! It's like a mousetrap. Nothing mm -hmm. wrist? Yeah. Alright, hard. Aya! So it seems like there's different ways to use it. Let's just go off these photos, right? Yeah. So Keep put it on your wrist, and that will magically give you a straight wrist. Whoa! <laughs> I think your hands are too big. It yeah, doesn't work. It doesn't work. The mouse is too low. <laughs> the mouse is meant to be here, forcing you to. stops me. Also, I don't want to do this. But yours. Nah, my hands are too big in the mouse. Nah, it big. has to be for two yeah, yeah. And then apparently you can put it on the fingerboard to shake your hand. Fingerboard? Yeah. Can you imagine just walking around public like this? Dude, that'd be the next fashion state. It's like, hello. Hiya! Can you take it off? It's good. Whoa! The perfect hand position, bro. But he can't play. <laughs> yeah, but he can't play. What's the point? Bunga bunga, bunga bunga. Bro, there's all these different ways to use it, but nah, none of them nah. look legit. Bow stopper. Nani? Oh, we got two bow stoppers here. I want to stop it, but let's See? just give them the bow stopper. Place the bow stopper close to the tip to help develop a tremolo. Wait, what? You know, like what the traditional white teachers do this? They just put a sticker. So they can see it. So you can see it. But you're not meant to have something stop you it. No, stop it. That's so bad. What? So everybody, I'm gonna. <laughs> I didn't even stop my bow. <laughs> 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 I went, I went faster. Wow, stop me, bro. Unga bunga, stop me. Whoa, stop her, bow stop her. You know what this is? This is when like, you know, the main character in the anime is too powerful and you have you to need have a, like limit. a limit. Yeah, 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 it's like a limit to... <laughs> tremolo, man. You gotta practice Oh, tremolo. okay, I gotta practice tremolo. <laughs> okay, go. <laughs> Dude, you can't practice tremolo! Dude, no! You're training the person to keep going until it stops. Yeah. So once you take it up, it's gonna go... Anyway, guys, not approved. This is like... Ungam Booga out of 10. Well, you gotta ask the mouse, what do you rate it? Ungam Booga! Oh, here we go. Picking cat! Oh my god! Cat? <laughs> ah! Helps the beginner stay in the highway. This only works if they're playing a piece and not on the G strong. But whoever wrote this needs to check the. It's like my spelling. <laughs> I, I write the website, I write the description for them, guys. You, you want the G strong? You put on the G string and you. The kid cannot play on the G string. Why? Apparently, so they both closer to the bridge. The Just bridge. both closer to. You don't need a freaking. You don't, you don't need things to stop you from. Oh my god. It just moves anyway. It doesn't even work. <laughs> oh, the poor cat died. Oh, oh, we got a cat and mouse. Bro, you're dripping. You get out. You got yeah. everything. See, this is it, guys. This is how you become a great violinist. What do you rate this? I rated a... Mia Mia. Out of the The sixth one is Wrist Rascal. Dude. What is that? Wrist Rascal solves the problem of collapsed wrist. Oh, are you serious? How does it stay? Do you use... Oh, you use this. I... Uh, I guess it's... I mean, it's a cheap instrument. Do you want to try? Does it help your wrist? Dude, you can't even shift! Whoa! Oh, just, oh. Yeah. Did you see that? That could have killed someone. Right, no, no rubber band, because it's dangerous. Yeah. I'm just gonna hold my wrist here. But how are you supposed to shift? Nah, this sucks. I can't get past. And even if you're in first position, position, what's the point? If you're in first position, you don't no even point. need it. If anything, I'm gonna do this. I'm just gonna be in first position and have a collapsed wrist anyway. I am in shock oh. of how lamentable these products are. It's so lamentable. Oh, what'd you rate this? I rated a Unga Miami out of 10. Oh, you just put it all together, dude. Dude, it's a freaking infinity glove. Yeah, give it go, go. The, just... the six infinity stones. Invisibility club. Dude, I'm so tense playing this. My whole body is tense. Alright, guys, that's it. Please access that like button, the gotta subscribe button, and we'll see you guys next time. Uh -huh.